Oh, it's Amazon girl. Canonically, she is the daughter of Blanca and Cham Cham. What's up everyone and welcome to a new Let's Play video. This time we're going back in time to rediscover a forgotten gem of the arcades era. It's Breakers. A very well known 2D fighting game at the time, but uh, which had become pretty forgotten as of late. A lot of gamers uh, aren't aware of uh, this uh, little gem, so it's very sad that uh, it became quite forgotten. That's why today we're going to shed some light at it, playing the Breakers collection that, that came not a long time ago. Have an intro with the characters, different characters, and of course, the service figure of the game, Tia. So the collection has two games, uh, Breakers and Breakers Revenge. Breakers, uh, Breakers Revenge is not a sequel or a different game, it's basically the first game with some updated stuff like uh, new characters, a new art style and some such. The game is very uh, beginner friendly, one may get into it very easily, combos come out uh, quite easily. Here we have the roster. Originally, it only had eight characters, but with the but in the revenge uh, installment, we have two additional ones: the ninjas, the ninja guy, which I forgot his name, and the boss, the final boss who became playable in this version. Here we're going with the main protag, Show. Basically, he's uh, he's real. Only he doesn't have a shoryuken. And we're fighting in Arab stereotype, Maherl. I don't know why they added that L. If they take it off, it would make a more common Arabic name, Maher. But who knows why? Anyway. I don't know for the other characters, but uh, Sho has three supers. Right, here we go with the second character, Piel. Again, if they replaced the L with R, it would make a more common French name. What's with the names in this game? But this guy makes some very strange noises. <laughs> it's very creepy. Stop. I know you're trying to be Vega, but uh, yeah, you're not a, you're not as memorable, unfortunately. No. As I said, he. Sho doesn't have a Shoryuken, but he does have a, an anti-air like uh, attack, which is this one. That's, uh, that's, a, that's actually a Rekka, and can act as an anti-air. He also has this super, which, uh, if you are attentive, looks very, very similar to Luke Super in Street Fighter 5 and 6. It can't be, it can't be... Oh no, that doesn't connect. That's BS. No, you got me. I was saying, that Super can't be a coincidence. It looks a lot like Luke Super. Then again, this game takes a lot, takes a lot of Street Fighter and uh, uses uh, the four button uh, layout of KOF. Light punch, heavy punch, light kick, heavy kick and that's it. You can also perform a dash, 
and it's uh, quite easy to get into. Now, I'm not saying that uh, being a proficient uh, gamer in breakers is easy. I'm basically a noob in this game. The last time I played it, uh, I don't know, it, it has been uh, over 20 years. I'm not uh, exaggerating. But I kept a very fond memory of it. I remember, I enjoyed it quite a lot. So when I saw that it was uh, ported to modern consoles, I jumped at it right away. Alright, Condor, I can tell you're trying to be T Hawk. Right, it worked. Also worked. That didn't work. <laughs> no. Right. This time I got you. There is no way that bicep flex would uh, your tear your uh, karate gi. It's not tight enough. Unless you become Hulk. Oh yeah, one thing that's uh, very peculiar in this game, mirror matches seem to be canon, because if you look, then their names are different. Mine is Sho, and the mirror guy is uh, Jin, so it's like a canon doppelganger, and it's the same uh, for the other characters. No, no. Calm down, mirror. It worked. Whoa, what's this? What's this recovery speed? BS. How could I punish that? No. Oh, oh. Run and throw. What is this? Samurai showdown? All right, stay down, take me. Oh, it's my rival buddy. I know he's a charge character. That's it. No. How could you have time to charge that? I know it's a charge move. Got you. No, chip, no. Ah. Got me with this sweep. How dare you taunt me? No, he got me. Really? Get off here. I can do that too. Punish your projectiles with a super. And your sweep with another super. Almost got him. I know. Oh, good. Got him! That super is good. 
Time service time! Is it just me or she reminds me a lot of Yuri? She has some Yuri in her. Also, her stage doesn't quite fit her. I see her more like in a... in a gym. That monkey is very excited. Hey, focus in your meditation or... Are we sleeping? No! That's also very reminiscent of uh, Yuri Super. Okay, her product side doesn't reach full screen. Did you know? I know. Okay, that's Chan Li's move. And that's Chan Li's wind pose too. Okay, she's a mix of Yuri and Chan Li. No, where is my super? How dare you toss me when you're losing? You deserve that. Get out of here. Oh, it's Amazon Girl. Canonically, she's the daughter of Blanca and Cham Cham. I'm oh, just kidding. I saw design a bit of a mix uh, of uh, these two characters, don't you think? No! Stop biting me! Got her! Got her! Didn't work. Oh. Could have punished us, maybe. Oh, never mind. Ooh, that's connected. Nice. That's what I like the most about this game. If you feel something may work... Oh, wait, oh, how could I punish that? Wait, never mind. Ninja guy. Saizo. Ah, he's annoying, I know he's going to be annoying. Oh no, I'm stunned. Wow. It wasn't a punish, but it still worked. Oh, someone in his pet. Alright, time to chip you. Got you. That didn't get him. That got him. All right. This guy can be really frustrating to fight sometimes. Not sometimes. Most of the times, actually. Oh, it's the mummy guy. Basically, he's uh, Egyptian Dalsim. Look at that. Okay, he has poison instead of uh, yoga fire. He has teleports. And stretchable limbs. Right. Glad I was far. 
Ooh, he escaped that. No. No, Riley got me with the teleports. Awesome. Although it traded. No. No. Oof. That was very close. Alright, time for the final boss. My power is a force of darkness, even your power looks faded in front of me. It's Tao Pai Pai from Dragon Ball. What? He just went through the fireball. What is this? Let's calm down, will you? Stop that. No. No. And a nunchaku. Everyone has a weapon except me. What is this? This is going to be a pain, isn't he? What is this now? You bison wannabe. Okay. No. Not okay. Oh! Got him! <laughs> I thought I threw it uh, too early. Still got him. Power Gazer! Sounds even super. Okay. Wow. Didn't have the time to do anything. Nine. He's going to be a pain, isn't he? It's an SNK boss, even though it's not a, an SNK game. And just uh, let me tell you something. This isn't uh, the first continue I'm making. I've been playing against this jerk for a while now. And by the way, I'm playing on easy. Yeah, this is uh, this is an old school fighter. That's certain. Oh no, he's gonna chip me on. What? what? He's free to move before I'm out of the stun block. What am I supposed to do against that? Yeah. I escaped that. I am sick of you. Ow. What am I supposed to do against that? Time to punish it. Uh, you know what? 
Time for my secret technique. Cheapness activated. That's what I'm gonna do. Not doing anything else. Oh no. Still got me. On this corner so badly, huh? Then go to it. He blocked, of course he did. Stop that, stop that, you're not bison, stop that. Alright. This worked. Oh, got him. No, he escaped from the second one. All right. Let's, let's be cheap again. No. I hate this super. What am I supposed to do against it? Almost dead. Okay. Oh no! Ah! Uh, I wanted to finish it with a super! No! Crap again. I am sick of you. By who? Yeah, I got him at last. And I still finished him with the super. Finally. What a jerk. What a big jerk. Right ending, the strongest martial artist in the world was possessed with an evil spirit, you don't say, that was quite obvious I would, <laughs> I would say. <laughs> Alright, he lives on a journey for aesthetic training to meet his own self and blah blah blah, he's Ryu, he's basically a Ryu. Alright, that was Breaker's Revenge, pretty cool game. If you have a modern platform, I'm playing on uh, PlayStation. If you have a PlayStation console, you can get it. I'd say it's uh, well worth it. It's a really good time. I'm glad I could make another retro playthrough of an old game, of a forgotten game like this one. All right. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did, and why not consider subscribing to the channel? Thanks for watching, and until next time.